It's all happening at the Singapore Indian Association and the Ceylon Sports Club, the Singapore Mariners Cricket Sixes 2008 for the second year in succession. Your strategies you want to highlight? My God. <laughs> We're not having a very good day today. Um, unfortunately, we've uh, we've had a bit of wayward bowling as well as some good bowling, and the wayward bowling just costs you. So uh, our batting's been pretty good. Uh, we've scored 50 runs twice, so uh, we're quite happy with that. And those are those are real runs, not extras. Uh, but the extras are killing us. So we're just uh, in the net at the moment, deciding uh, who we will uh, who will pick uh, and, and what our strategy for bowling will be in the next game. We win the toss, uh, probably uh, bat at the moment because I think uh, uh, we'd like to make somebody else chase and get a bit of pressure on them this time. in the second one against you. Thanks with all the help with the wides, 52 runs. And let's see. We should be able to make it to the quarterfinals. And let's take it. Now we can see a nice loud cheer from the teams as the fielding team is going out to play the first game of the Singapore Marina Sixes 2008. This game is between Lloyd's Register and AP Mola. My name is Balak I'm a Marina myself living in Singapore for the last 16 years. Uh, to give you a little bit of history on how the Mariners came into play cricket here, uh, it was in 1994-95 when a couple of Mariner friends uh, joined together. Uh, some of the names I would like to mention is Captain Sandeep Rana, who was sort of instrumental in the whole thing. Together with me, uh, Mr. Ramakrishnan from Masterball, Anut Sahai, who is now with Lloyds, and used to work with World Tankers. Uh, uh, Anand Gokhale, Captain A.K. Oh, to name some of them, Captain Gore. Uh, we joined together and we decided that we will form an association, have cricket as one of the means of communicating between the Mariners because there were very few here in Singapore. And by 1999, we soon found that uh, we were running short of the players. In 2000, I managed to get a team from Tanker Pacific. They had a lot of team players and encouraged them to play. We played a lot of games and very soon... Tanker we would request the two team. teams to please start the second game. Tanker Pacific versus V-Ships. Morning it was raining, but the raining we put this one the start. The raining stopped already. Still, the, but some river also stopped already. No more the rain already stopped already. What is the idea? Our ideas like that. I was uh, extremely glad to be here with all all people from our industry. Now, we think that shipping is all hardware business actually with ships and steel and all, but basically we are people business. And uh, to have our people happy and get together is a great achievement. Thank you Lloyds. Thank you the Singapore Cricket Association. Well done, good job. We have a very special token here, Mr. Ying Hing Leong of Lloyds Registry. And most importantly, we are now going to, there's going to be a toss here. Uh, the stakes are very, very high, so please back the person that you want to. We're going to have a toss between uh, Captain Surin Dutt, the Managing Director of Middle <laughs> Eastern, and of course, Yen Hing Leong. It's a heads I win, tails I lose situation. Heads. And of course, Mr. Heads it is. Yen Hing Leong has won the toss as usual. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, welcome everybody on behalf of the organizing committee. Uh, it's great to see a fantastic turnout today. 
a big response, so many teams here. Great thanks to Lloyd's Register for organizing this, to the Singapore Cricket Association. It was a bit of a gloomy start this morning, but I think the sun's come out, we're going to have a great day's cricket and may the best team win. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much for all for coming here. Uh, as uh, <coughs> we've said, uh, we're very happy that the weather is good. Hope it holds and uh, hope everyone enjoys itself. Thank you very much. And I just have one more question, ladies and gentlemen, for Mr. Hing. I want to ask him what his experiences was as a cricketer. Don't forget, he started playing cricket just yesterday. <laughs> what, what was the experience like, sir? I think it's a, bit, a little bit like golf. Right? <laughs> well, he really did get a hole in one, and that's what he's all about. Three cheers to all these gentlemen. <laughs> hip hip. Hey! Hip hip. Hey! Hip hip. And three cheers to all the cricketers and of course the Singapore Mariners, the fraternity and everybody who's here. Hip hip! Hooray! Hip hip! Hooray! Hip hip! Hooray! Okay, now we're going to have a small little session in, out there on the field where we're going to see these gentlemen, especially somebody who's just learned how to play cricket. We're going to watch them in action. Captain Surendra, Mr. Hing, and of course Mr. Hemant Patanda for having spend some time with us, quality time with us and having seen some magnificent cricket, some great hitting, some lusty bowling, some lusty hitting, some fantastic tight economical bowling, some super feeding, one wicket are KNI, they need 61. Careful to come to the CAC desk. A very interesting match which is happening the second semi-finals between uh, Tiger Pacific and Keppel. Keppel are batting right now. Holding the champions, the people are holding on luck if I may put it that way in the win-win draw. Now he's turning around to take the guard, the bowler goes back on his, uh, uh, on his line up. Okay, bowler comes into ball. And that's a foolish delivery, Raji. So amazing shot. Thank you. That is amazing. Second over in progress. Raji, easy! Easy, easy! Good shot, good shot, good shot, good shot! Good shot, good shot! Good shot! Yes, yes, one more, one more, one more! One for the throw, one for the throw! One for the throw, Ken! This is good, yeah, come on. He took the match almost to the wire, but Elan were a little too superior to them. And played. Started, Samir Apte is uh, opening the ball for them. Beauty. Uh, but only one run. Tanka Pasek is And they are... Oh! The wicketkeeper managed to miss the ball and it's four runs.